Hello, we're back here again with your self-proclaimed best internet girl, Carmilla. Today we'll be playing a pixel horror game called The Strained. Let's delve what's so scary about this mobile pixel horror game. New game. My humanity was for sale, and I sold it. That very moment sent me into decay. This is my story, and these are my regrets. Oh, he's starting up strong. I guess we're looking for something. I just came here. Excuse me. I'm looking for Mrs. Goodwin. She's not here. Go away. Guess it's not this one. Anyone home? Wh who's there? Mrs. Goodwin? No, no, she lives next do door. Thank you and goodbye. I'm looking for Mrs. Goodwin. Is this the right address? No! Get lost! Huh? I could swear she lives somewhere around here. Yes, without a doubt. It's got to be one of these doors. I guess the one who hesitates to answer? It smells of blueberry pie. This must be the right apartment. Uh, I told you she does not live here. Madam, I know it's you. Could you please let me in? I'm sorry, co come on in, please. Oof. That's so beautiful, yet so... The color seems so dark. Madame. I know. I'm so sorry. I have to do this, madame. Can't you let me a little more time? I can pay the debt if you give me another week, please. I I'm sorry. I hate doing this. But I must size this property. Oh no, she's crying! It breaks my heart! But where would I go? This is all I have! I'm sorry, madam. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be crying like this. There are just so many memories here. I understand, madam. Oh, where are my manners? Would you like to have a cup of tea? I'd rather have a cup of coffee if possible. Oh, of course. Give me a second, young man. Oh. <sighs> Might as well look around while waiting. We're going to size her property? <sighs> this is the worst. This game just started and I feel like we're on a roller coaster of horror. It's a rocking chair. Every granny has one. I can't leave now even if I want it. Mm. Oh! It's a wedding photo of Mr. and Mrs. Goodwin. Though I believe she is a widow now. Oh man, I shouldn't be doing this. Oh, oh man. Oh, what happened? What was that? I'm sorry, dear. I'm afraid I've run out of coffee. Can I get you something else instead? No, thank you, madam. Listen. You'll have to move out by the end of the month. I am very, truly sorry, madame. Well, I guess 
I have only myself to blame. Yes, well, I need to get going, madame. Take care. Wait a second, young man. Maybe if we just... Never mind, dear. I really must go now. Take care. Bye-bye, dear. This is the worst. This is the worst. I can't. I can't. This is the worst. I have so many regrets doing this. Let's go now. Nothing happened. Power seems to be on though. Weird. I just want to get away from here. What is that? Ugh. A door opened. This is probably a very bad idea. Of course! You're going to go to whatever door opened and... Living room. It's not as it's... Okay. Game saved. Whatever that means. It's locked. I need a key. Ugh. What's that? I turn it off if there was a power button. Oh shit. That's a note. What comes around goes around. Fuck it. The bathroom? Oh shit. It's freezing here. There's something in the bathtub. Let's see. <sighs> it's cold. There. This might come in handy. Okay. I don't need another ice cube. Okay then. I understand. Hmm. I don't need to pee. Where is she? What the hell was that? Where should we go? Oh. It's locked. I need a key. Oh. It's empty. It's an old oven. Should we try to use the ice cube on the oven? I wonder if there's something inside this ice cube. I'll stick it into the oven. oven. Now we wait. Alright, let's see. I knew it. Yes, we found a key. Now let's use it on the locked door. I unlocked the door. That sound again. Stock markets, economy, trading. There are a lot of books about money. It's empty. There is something here. Find the skippers. Oh, so many books about money. I don't think this is the right place for this book. Okay, let's search a place where we could Try to put in the book. This bookcase is full of horror books. I'll place this book here. Oh, what's that? Another book popped out. I think I know where to put this. <laughs> oh no. 
Oof. This? All these books are about money. This book will fit here perfectly. Let's see. Done. Oh. Ah, the music, yo. The music. Oh. Yes? Son! Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. McDate, Britain, and more. We already heard you kick that expired fart out. Oh my god, so rude! So rude! Job well done, son! You passed your first trial! Happy to hear that, sus! Although Mrs. Goodwin seems like a very nice old- Nonsense! 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 There's no injustice in the law. You did the right thing, son. Soon, you will be one of us. One of us! One of us! Make that, Britain, more, and price. I like the sound of it. Thank you, sus. Are you ready to make some serious money? Money, money. I guess I am. You have only two more names to take care of. Size their properties in the name of the law. In the name of the law. In the name of the law. And you shall be granted a partnership. I will. That's the spirit, son! How have you go now? Okay. Where should we go? Money. So creepy! Look at the stairs! Oh. Okay then. I guess we're going to go to another one. Of those unfortunate people to seize their property. I felt both joy and sorrow. Soon I would get my partnership. But at the price of my humanity. Would it be worth it? Game save. Whatever that means. What's that? Huh? How did it get here? There's another note. There's an elephant in the room. I know that saying. Oh! Oh no 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 Oh! Run! Avarice. Indignity. Guilt. Vanity. Indignity. Ah! It's... Come, it's getting closer. No, 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 no. Oh no! No, 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 no! I guess it was. Oh. Oh my God, the guilt! I hate this. Oh, is it morning already? What a day that was. I still feel horrible about Mrs. Goodwin. Oh well, I need some coffee to wake up. Let's make some coffee. Okay, I need some water for the coffee. I'll use this coffee pot to get the water. Where's the water? Not much and longer I'll get to move out of this dump. I don't think so. From the toilet. Oh yes, from here. Maybe I'll get some water here. Ha, oh, I want coffee. And it starts raining. Oh, are you kidding me? One of those mornings, I swear you. Coffee, rain, it's perfect, yo. I need water for the coffee. What? I thought we get our water. The water is off. From here? I really need my caffeine. Nobody needs to know. <laughs> oh my god, gross! Gross! No, I still have a little dignity left. <laughs> From where can we get our water from? 
from the rain. It wouldn't work. I need my coffee. I also need to change out of my pajamas. Okay. Nope, no water here. Oh! Yes, not sure how hygienic this is. But every man deserves a cup of coffee. There, I have some water now. Okay, let's make our coffee. What? What just happened? Finally! I'll put the water here. Okay, I'll watch some telly while the coffee is brewing. Open up the television. Where is the television? Oh, op, 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 op. This is the loo. Um. Oh, yes, here. Oh, yeah, it's thundering. I shouldn't risk it. Is our coffee ready? What was that? I think it came from the bathroom. Okay. It is the bathroom. There's nothing here. Must be my imagination. Hmm. Coffee should be ready by now. Okay. What? Who are they? Our parents? Maybe? <laughs> You're right, dear. How silly that day was. Oh, look there. It's our little boy. I can see that, hon. Hey, son. You don't mind that we took some coffee, do you? Although it tasted a little funny. No, not at all. Are you right, dear? You look so pale. Aren't you supposed to be, you know, dead? Of course we are dead. What a silly thing you say. But, even though we are already gone, does it make you crazy to hear our words of wisdom? I suppose not. And that's exactly why we are here. So listen to us, son, and let us, and let your conscience do the talking. Sounds reasonable. We heard some, well, unpleasant things about you, D. That is correct. We are worried about you, me, and your father. Are you getting greedy, son? It is not too late to make a change. Look, I'm not proud of all the things I've done. But look at this cranky apartment. I just want to be successful in my life. We understand, son. But all the expense of the other people? Think about it, son. You're better than that. I don't know. I've worked hard for this. What's that? I'm looking for Mrs. Goodwin. Is this the right address? Oh. What the hell is going on? Let's answer the window. I'm not ready to leave yet. I need my coffee. I also need to change out of my pajamas. Our conscious do all the talking. The coffee is gone. What? It's a kitchen sink. It's been a while since I last used my oven. Take away for the win. Okay. Let's change our clothes. Where's the wardrobe? <gasps> it's blood. Hold it together. It's only my mind playing tricks on me. Yes, it must be. Okay, I better get dressed. <sighs> oh. It was rough yesterday, but I decided to carry on. Though, I would be lying to you if I said I didn't think of Mrs. Goodwin. Anyways... Mr. Taylor was the next name on my list. He lived in a forest as a hermit. He had no debt, but the city wanted to expropriate his property. 
They built a highway there. I visited him so I could size his property. No trespasses. He's living in the woods. His cabin should be here somewhere. Okay. It's a long way to go. Oh, there it is. Mrs. Price, I'm looking for Mrs. Taylor. Hello? Either he's not at home or he's ignoring me. I need to talk to him. It's a firewood stack. Okay. Oh, it's locked. Is he somewhere in the woods? Okay, I see a fireplace and a man. Hello. You must be Mr. Taylor. I am. My name is Price. Nice to meet your acquaintances. Please drop the act and let me hear your threats. I know why you are here. Threats? No, no. How about reasoning? You see, Mr. Taylor, the city wants to build a highway here. It would bring lots of new people and tourism to the city. And a lot of money too, or am I mistaken? Well, that's exactly the problem with you people. Money is your king. Where's your compassion? This is my home. Sir, it's been quite a long day already. Everything is already prepared. And don't forget we are offering you a very fair compensation. And if you refuse, we will have to expropriate your property. I guess I have no options but to bend over. There, you got me. I hope you are happy. I'm sorry, sir. Sorry, kid. I know you're just doing your work. Sir, if there's anything I could do, there is something. It's getting chilly out here. Let's talk in my cabin. Here, take this key. I'll follow you shortly. Oh, and while you are at it, could you light a fire in the fireplace? Of course. Thank you, sir. Okay, let's get into the cabin. I unlocked the door. Ooh. There's ashes here. I need to make a fire. What? Oh, so many rooms. It smells oddly horrible. It's a trash can full of paper. And the window, crosswords, search word. He seems to like puzzles. Okay, it's his room. We are searching for things to make firewood, firewood of. It's locked. There's something matches perfect. Let's search for some woods. Is this the bathroom? It's a bathtub. There's quite a strong smell from it. Oh. Did he just murder someone in the bathtub? I need to make fire. Matches? Oh. We need firewood fast. Outside. I think we saw some firewood. Yes, he. It's a firewood stack. I'll take some firewood he. Okay. And then light the firewood. Here goes. Damn it. The firewood is all moist. 
Honey is something that ignites easily. Paper, perhaps? Oh, yes. The trash can? Nothing interesting here. It's locked. Where did I see the... Oh, here. I can use the paper I found earlier for kindling. Okay. Let's light up some fire. Okay. This should do. Aha! Look what I've created. I have made fire. Oh, I see you made fire. Good, thank you. My pleasure. It's so dark in here. Yes, there is no electricity. But back to the topic. See, my dog has gone missing. And you want me to find him? Her? Her. It was quite a mysterious disappearance. How so? Well, she was here when I went to the bed last night. And as far as I'm aware, she can't open doors. And yet she has gone at the break of dawn. Huh? Then she must be inside. So I thought. But I can't find her anywhere. If you find her, I'll happily sign any papers you may have. You got yourself a deal, sir. I'll start my investigation. Good luck, kid. Okay. Let's find the dog. Um. Did he murder the dog? Oh. Ooh. The music got kind of creepy. Nothing interesting here. Okay, save first. Maybe outside. Oh, no, key. Yes, maybe outside. Let's search outside. Or his bedroom. I don't know where if we should find the dog. <sighs> okay, this dog bed smells like piss and soap. Might be important. I'll ask Mr. Taylor about this. I noticed that the dog bed smells funny. Yeah, we had a little skunk accident yesterday. Oh, the smell. Anyways, we spent a good hour scrubbing the stink away. Lots of water and lots of shampoo. That explains the smell. I'm sure this helps. I'll look into it. Outside, maybe? Here, it's locked. Oh, we can't get past there. Mm. I'm recording, right? Okay, okay, okay. Skunk, eh? Yeah. Oh, 
Where to find some skunk? Okay, let me think. If the dog bed already thinks that bad, I wonder what the dog will smell like. I think I can follow her scent. Okay, we're following the scent. Ah! What is that? Oof. Ha! There's a hole in this door. The dog must have gone through here. The door is locked with a combination lock. I can't follow her. I'll talk to Mrs. Taylor. Ooh, I've got a pretty bad feeling about this. There's a locked door in the hallway. Where does it lead? Why? Well, there's a hole in the door. I believe the dog has gone through it there. Hmm. That would make sense. There's an old underground cellar behind that door. But I haven't used it in years. I could take a look. But I need a com combination for the lock. Oh yes, that was it. It's so long, you see? I'm afraid I've forgotten the combination. But I'm no fool, so I have a backup. That's great. Where can I find it? See? I love puzzles of all kind. I believe I hid the combination in one of the puzzles. If I remember correctly, the word you'll need is tree. Yes, that's the word. Okay, I'll take a look. Hey kid, thanks for going through all the trouble. Don't worry about it. Okay. Let's find the puzzle. Tree. Is, is it here? No. Where is his puzzle? Ah! It's so confusing! The hallway. Ah! Where is the puzzle? Oh, his room. Tree. It must be the puzzle he meant. Okay. Tree. T. Okay. Got it. Yes. That's it. Ugh. What is that? Did the dog die? It's a washing machine. Doesn't work, there's no electricity. Save hers. It's an old compressor. Let's see if there's still some juice in it. Nothing happened. Oof. There's a hole in the wall and the floor. The dog has gone through here, no doubt about it. Oof. What's that sound? I hope this isn't her blood. Ugh. Ah, I hate it. Ah. 
Hey girl. I don't have the guts to get any closer. She is eating something. I think it's fox plot. What should we get her? Is there anything we could give the dog? Let's get inside first. Maybe we should ask the owner about this. Hammer saw wrench nails. Huh, what's that? I doubt this gasoline can be... Con... Come in handy. I unlocked the door. Okay. Let's ask the owl owner about the door. I'll just talk to him once I find his door. Okay. Let's power up the compressor in the cellar. Not he. Where is the compressor again? Oh, here. I'll fill the compressor with this gasoline. Okay, here goes nothing. Look at that. The power is on now. Let's see. What is that? What was that? It's a glow scotch scare for a moment. Oh, we can use the glove to pet the dog, I guess. So she won't bite our hand. That's it. Yes, I'm a genius. Hey, girl. That's it. Come here. Who's a good girl? Oof! Your master is worried about you. You should go home. Good girl. Alright. Back to the cabin. Oof. Elephant again. Oh no. What? I can't go back this way. What the hell was that all about? Oh. You found her. Thanks, kid. I signed the papers. You can find them inside. I will leave immediately. Feels easier that way. Farewell, sir. Okay, I better get the papers. Oh! Son! Good to see you! Good to see you! Good to see you! Make date, Britain! And more. Another job well done. Well done. Well done. For a moment I thought you were going soft. 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 Doing him a favor by finding his lousy mutt. He seems like a vet. Nonsense. 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 
You shouldn't just kick his wordless ass. Wordless ass. Wordless ass. Next time you must remain strict. 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 I understand. Do you know? You wouldn't want to make us regret choosing you. No, sus. That's the spirit. Thank you for this opportunity, sus. That reminds me. Something of great importance. Importance! Importance! What's that? We have yet to see you dance, son. Uh oh. Now dance, son. Yes, sir. What's this? That's our boy. Yeah! Now faster! It's another nightmares, I guess. Ooh. What's this phone call? Don't tell me something bad happened to her. Yes? Is this Mr. Price speaking? Yeah. My name is Stewards. I'm sorry to bother you at such a late hour. What is this all about? It's Mrs. Goodwin. I know you're not relative, but I'm afraid she has no one else. She asked me to call you. See? She had a stroke yesterday. Oh. How is she doing? Well, considering the seriousness of the stroke, she is fine. But she is in very bad spirits. And when the mind fails, the body will follow. I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. I'm sorry. I don't know what to say. I understand, but she asked specifically for you, Mr. Price. Could you consider visiting her here in our care? I'm sure it would mean a lot to her. Yes, I will happily do it. Thank you, Mr. Price. I'll bring the message to her. I'm sure she will be delighted. Thank you, Mr. Stewards. What happened to her? I hope she's okay. I feel so bad after kicking him, after kicking her out of her apartment and then we're going to visit her because she doesn't have anyone else to visit. Oh, it's so sad. Huh? Huh? What a nightmare. Oh shit. I wonder how Mrs. Goodwin is doing. Maybe I should visit her for my own sake. Do I need some coffee? I need coffee. I'll just suit up later. Okay. Coffee it is. Ah. My new coffee maker is the Deluxe 2000 X748 G3. One press of a button is enough. No more fetching water from the weirdest of places. Luxury, one could call it. What's that? Huh? Who might that be? It's a phone. Hello, this is Price speaking. Mr. Price? This is Stuart speaking. I'm calling from our nursing home on behalf of Mrs. Goodwin. Is everything okay? 
She had a stroke. She had a stroke, but she's doing relatively fine. What? It's the same as our nightmare. Let me guess. She asked me to visit her. Impressive, Mr. Price. Indeed, it would mean the world to her. Could you please consider doing so? Yes, of course, I'll come to see her. Thank you, Mr. Price. I'll let her know. Thank you for calling me. My dreams of guilt are coming true. Well, the parents. Ha 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 ha. You're right, dear. I will never forget that day. Oh, look, dear. It's our little boy. I can see that, hon. Hey, son. You don't mind that we took some coffee, do you? The coffee tasted great this time. Not at all. Since you are here, I guess you have something important to tell me. That is correct, son. It seems you are still pursuing the riches at the expense of the others. What your father is trying to tell you is that you are losing yourself in the process. I think I know what you mean. But I can't quit now. I'm so close to success. How about Mrs. Goodwin? We heard she's not doing too good. Don't you think she would rather be at her home? I know. I feel horrible for her. Maybe you would understand if you saw the consequences of your actions. You should go and see how Mrs. Goodwin is doing. Hey, you don't need to be so pushy. No, son, we do. We are only thinking about what is best for you. Sorry, I know that. See, you can be very compassionate, honey. Is anyone home? I'm looking for Mrs. Price. Oh man, I'm losing my mind. Okay, focus. Okay, focus. Drink the coffee and suit up. I need to get my head straight. Is the coffee gone again this time? Oh, it's still there. Damn good coffee. Okay, I'll get dressed and I'm off. Oh, she's alone in a nursing home. Alright, I'll pay Mrs. Goodwin a visit. I hope she's okay. I traveled to meet Mrs. Goodwin. I hated myself. But maybe, but maybe, if I confront her, maybe I could find peace of mind. Hello? Anyone there? I'm here to see Mrs. Goodwin. Speaking of service. How are you? Okay, take care. Good day, madam. I'll get going now. Snow. No wonder these folks are so absent. Uh, I hate this. I hate this. <laughs> Can I get past, please? No point. He's sleeping like a rock. Oh, no. Oh no, we let Mrs. Goodwin here. There's no way I can get past that. What's that? What the hell is this program? I better just leave it. Okay. Potatoes, potatoes, potatoes. Potatoes! I refuse! I shall not cook anything. No. Potatoes. My skills are going to waste. I refuse. I need better ingredients. It would be nice to have some meat every now and then. Go away. Get lost. What? Hello. I am frustrated. Only potatoes after potatoes. Yes, I overheard the conversation. Savings, they call it. These people need better food. But I can't provide them with only potatoes. I'm sorry. 
Leave me alone. Okay, then. It's locked. Where should we go? Bathroom? I don't need to wash my hands right now. I don't like using public toilets. Yes. No one would like that. There's no way I can get past that. Okay then, where should we go? Anyone there? No answer. What's this? Oh, I thought I heard something. Hey kid, could you do an old man a favor? Sorry, who are you? Janitor Carpenter at your office. My name is Price. Nice to meet you. And sure, what do you need? I was in the middle of something, but then the electricity went off. I'm guessing the circuit breaker tripped. There's a fuse box near the kitchen. Could you check the fuses over there? I guess I'm not in a hurry, so why not? Thanks, kid. I'll let you borrow my key. Tell no one. Alright, I'll be right back. Ooh, it's so dark in here. Where is the kitchen? Is this the kitchen? Besides, that would be rude. Is this the kitchen? There's no keyhole. I don't know. Where should we go? Um... Is this the... Oh, no, it's not the kitchen. Is this it? I unlocked the door. Okay, then. This must be the fuse box. Let's see. Oh. Oh, it must be... Something like an order or something. Yes, yes, yes. Wait, wait, wait. Let me figure out. Oh. Oh, yes. Maybe like this. Ah! No? Not that? Okay, got it. The electricity should be back on. Okay. There are so many doors. Oh, what's that sound? I hate it when scary sound play in the background. Anyone there? No answer. Okay. Let's... What's he doing? Hey. Hey. Oh, thanks kid. Electricity is back on. What the hell are you doing? I'm disposing of this corpse. Corpse? Who is that? This some old stars. He died in a few days back. It's cheaper this way. Oh, I feel sick. What's that? Oh, I'm gonna throw up at any moment now. Piles of guts, body fluids and blood. This will have to do. Are you thinking of what I'm thinking? We're going to feed them some meat. We're going to feed them some meat. Human meat. Their own kind. Oh, I feel sick. Here's your meat. I happen to come across this fine piece of beef. Beef my ass? Do you think it could be suitable for your purposes? Let's take a look. Yes. Oh, brilliant. Meets back on the menu, boys. Thank you, young master. I'll start cooking right away. My pleasure. Oh god. Why? 
Why did you do that? Why do you have to do that? Oh, curses! Oh, there's someone. Oh, he's disposing of the corpse. Deception. It's not reception anymore, but it's deception. Let's save it fast. This makes me sick. This makes me sick to my stomach. What is this? They're full of absent-minded people and they feed them whatever. Potatoes and they don't have a proper burial. It's so... Disgusting. I don't want to imagine this kind of thing. Okay, let's join in the conversation. I have prepared my beautiful dish. Finally, these people will get the food they deserve. Speaking of that, I'm here to see Mrs. Goodwin. Can I take the food to her? Sk Shock it. Take this dish to her. Thank you, chef. We're going to feed Mrs. Goodwin some human meat? You are sick. You are sick. Room service? Well, sort of. Do you bring food? I'm hungry. Yes. Can I come in, please? Please do. Oh my god. This is sick. You're not Mrs. Goodwin. Oh, I'm afraid you've got the wrong room, dear. Sorry, I didn't mean to sound rude. Here's the food. Thank you, dear. Oh, I'll get going. It's been a long time since anyone came to see me. I'm sore. I think it was two months ago. My grandchild came to see me. I really need... But I haven't heard from him since. Though I believe he got married lately. That's nice to eat. Wait a girl. What was her name again? Was it Helen? I wouldn't know. No, I believe it was Helga. That's nice. But I'm up. Her father got his ankle broken. I wonder if he's alright now. I'm sure he is. I'll take care now. It has been awfully windy lately. Fall is going to come early this year. Yeah. I'm sorry, madam. I really need to get going now. Oh! There I go, rambling on again. I understand you must be going now. Please take this for listening to my nonsense. Thank you, madam. I wish you well. I wish you well. On the reception, I go. Okay. We're on the reception. Service, please. Finally. I know. Listen, there's a door behind the bars. I think I left my wallet there. So. Uh-huh. That's a yes, I take it. Yes. Perfect, I suppose. We're going through the bar doors. 
Those with paws. Okay. What's this? Flower? Oh man. I wonder how long she has been here. These people are treated like cattle. I don't think she needs the flower anymore. I'll take it to Miss Godwin. Okay. Where? The door won't budge. Okay. What do we do? Oh, I know. We take the flower. And we give her the cobalt. Okay. Got it. Now we have to find Mrs. Goodwin. Where the hell is Mrs. Goodwin anyway? Is this here? It's the bathroom. Or well, maybe somewhere else. How is it going? Wonderful. You wouldn't believe my frustration. Thanks for getting that beef to me. Sure. Is this here? No. Where is her room? Oh, maybe the one with the old man. Is it here? Ahem. Can I get a pass, please? No point. He's sleeping like a rock. Save now. Is this here? I found a hanger. What should I hang with? I wouldn't want to start another conversation. Please don't step there, there. It's so dirty. Alright, madam. Oh! I get it. I get it. The television on the reception. Yes. On the hallway, hallway. Lobby. Yeah, lobby. We can use this hanger with the TV, maybe? I think I could bend this hanger to act as an antenna. Yes, I'm big brain. Ha! It worked. I'm a genius. Ken Backcock is airing. Okay. Okay then. Enjoy your television. This had got to be Mrs. Goodwin's room. But before I enter, I'll find her a flower. It is the polite thing to do after all. Okay. I'm with the flower. Mrs. Goodwin. This is Price. Can I come in? I'm here. Come in, please. I was nervous and afraid. I didn't know what to expect. Maybe she would blame me. I was concerned about her well-being. I felt guilty and ashamed. Hello. I brought you a flower. How are you, Mrs. Goodwin? Oh, you shouldn't have. Thank you, dear. I am delighted you came to see me. Of course, madam. I still feel horrible for taking over your home. I shouldn't have done that. Stop it, you young man. You shouldn't blame yourself. Thank you, Mrs. Goodwin. That means a lot to me. But still, can I do something for you? Anything at all? No, I... No, I have no one. I just wanted to see a familiar face before I'm gone. Madame, you don't deserve this. I'm the spineless Caliwack. But let me make this right. You could move to my place. I'll take care of you. It's not much, but anything beats this. Oh! Oh, you're such a polite young man! 
But I can't do that, dear. You have your own life and things to take care of. Me? Me? I'm old. I won't be around for too long. Madame, don't say that. No, listen to me. Don't you blame yourself, young man. Besides, soon I will get to see my husband again. Madame, I will come to see you every week. You can always call me if you want to talk. Thank you. Oh my god, I can't. This is a horror in another level. Oh my god. I feel sorry. I feel sorry. I was so close. One more name. One last push. But something. But something. Something had changed. Something inside me tried to make me stop. I ignored that something. I didn't stop. Mr. Jones was the last name on my list. Mrs. Goodwin. She doesn't deserve all of that. But this is my job. Okay then, I should get going now. Don't forget to click the like and subscribe to my channel for more. Because I'm going to release more videos soon. Bye.